Hey everybody, this is Falaran, and we are back with Lords of Football. Now, you might remember this guy. He, uh, he was the guy <laughs> that I created last time. And, uh, as you can see in the background, it used to be a stadium, now it's a, a, like a locker room. The reason for that is, um, I realized later on that you couldn't just it's it's not possible to just stop customizing your team and saving it you have to start the game or it won't be saved so that was kind of annoying but um, I redid everything and uh, let's go edit the players I've already put the names in there I've had 14 people I think 14 people um, gave me their names for the team and I filled the rest up with people that I know from gaming and uh, YouTube in general and uh, I've tr I've gone through them by um, in the sequence of how they were posted so we're gonna look at these now here we go Started out with Dunkai. Dunkai didn't really offer his name for a character uh, because he says, "If my character was any reflection of myself, I would just turn up, play the match, and go back to my flat until the next match and play video games." Well, that's just that sounds perfect to me, Dunkai. So you have become number eight, Dunkai Johnson, England. Now I want to say right here and right now. If I didn't have a last name that I could use, I just made something up, or a first name, for that matter, you'll see. And uh, if I didn't, I wasn't sure what your country was, I took England or something that I thought was funny or, you know, something like that. So, next one was Passion. Passion wanted to be called Akipa Anderson. And I figured, let's give Dunkai a buddy in... Uh, in midfield and made passion a central midfielder so very good then we have Yami Jerry Yami Jerry wanted to be called only Yami nothing else the thing however is if I do this as you will see it comes right back but I found a way to circumvent that I'm gonna give him the nickname Yami that way he will just be called Yami in game then we had Keeper Balance, aka Tony Stark from Canada. He wanted to be a defender. There you go. Now, I have to say, getting back to Yami real quick, uh, Yami wanted to be number 13 or either right attacking midfield or striker. Now, I, I can't change the numbers, sadly, which is kind of annoying. I wanted to change them, but it doesn't work. So you're number 10, right wing. Then we have, uh, after Tony, we have I'm Zio. Um, you gave me A dot Zio, and you wanted to be goalkeeper or uh, striker. Well, I made you a goalkeeper. I named you Andre, and first I wanted to have you from Italy, but then I clicked a little too far, <laughs> and now you're from Jamaica. I hope that's okay with you. Uh, next, we have from Portugal, our striker, Ja Jr. Uh, we have from England, Tim May, number 8, defender. I'm afraid that wasn't possible because 8 is uh, midfield. Then, uh, Dan the Let's Play Man wanted to be Libero. And take number 3. Both wasn't possible, but, you know, you're number two now. Libero, Switzerland. Dan the Let's Play Man. Bring it back for you, uh, Dan. And then we have Zorin. Zorin didn't really ask to be <laughs> in the game. Well, that's just tough luck, right? You're in. And uh, to answer your question, Zorin, no, I'm not, probably not going to Gamescon. That might actually change. 
Um, then we have Louis Baker. He wanted to be number 88 central defender. I'm afraid that wasn't possible. But I made you number 3 central defender. And you are... Your nickname is call is the Saint as you wanted it to be. Then we have Alfonso Cross. Any number, but one or two would be good. Sorry, those are already gone. So you are now uh what is that? Some kind of defender. Right. Oh, this is not Libero. Well <laughs> then I'll I'll use you as a Libero, don't worry. Let's see, can I fix this? Tim, you want it to be, let's fix it like this. Tim May. Oop. And Dan the man, that way you're the central one of those. And uh, now there's here's another thing that's quite stupid about this game. I can't just type in which country I want them to be from. I can't click or anything. I need to actually click every single time this changes. I can't just stay on it. That's really annoying. Oop, there we go. And Tim. You know what? So I don't have to click all the way. You're from the United States now. I hope you're okay with that. If you aren't, I really hope I can change stuff later on. And if I can't, then... Sorry. <laughs> Alright, we have Alfonso Cross. Um... And finally we have Larry Red J. He wanted to be called the Cucumber. Larry the Cucumber. <laughs> so, there you go. Larry the Cucumber. Um, that's it for the first page. Then we go to the second page. We have Darzer. Darzer just said, put Darzer in somewhere. Here you go, Darzer. You're uh, on the bench. Sorry. And uh, your name is Stockton. <laughs> Nickname England. No. <laughs> Mr. England. Like this, Mr. England. Well, well, we'll leave that out. And we have I now are the those the following are the people that I just picked because I uh, felt I needed some more names to fill up the the, the roster. So we have Graleth from Denmark, Geronimo from Switzerland, Tib USA, Guitar Flat USA. I have a lot of Americans in this. Um, that's all right though. Guitar flat, Senor, Senor flat, <laughs> and we'll call him the blame. Ethan, Aaron Rouge, we'll call him Scorpion. Uni, the doctor. Eli Beatmaker, there you go. And Miguel Manjarati, the ninja, the nun. <laughs> Sorry, Miguel. You know it. You know it. It's a joke. <laughs> All right. Save that. And let's start this game. Let's hope. Oh, already almost 10 minutes. What? No, they don't. Ah, oh, man. Home and away kit. Look, it's black! Alright, let's, uh, let's change the base color to red. There we go. And there we go. Shorts. And socks. Okay, okay, okay. Do I need to take a look at the goalkeeper kit? He is like this here, and yeah, that is different, so don't be bothering me anymore. Start game, yes! Here you go, when you've picked up a game, you can still move around the world and track the. Aha! Alright, very good. 
Fast food. Welcome Whoa. to the greatest job on the planet. Hello, you're the loud. first law in every world class manager's rule book is <laughs> know Junior. your footballers. <laughs> oh yes. Knowing the team's strengths, weaknesses, likes and dislikes allows Soren. you to develop them correctly, while knowing how to motivate them to perform like stars on the way to becoming the champions the of Europe. Saint. <laughs> All right, that guy was really loud, and this is showing me my guy. Senor Flat, <laughs> awesome guitar flat. You're totally a seducer. <laughs> Outgoing wine steward, Ethan. Forward, shy, ungrateful, quiet. Mm -hmm. Dunkai, central midfielder. <laughs> oh my god, look at that guy. He's awesome. <laughs> Yami, oh my god, Yami, you're really cool, ungrateful, sophisticated, money, I, I can, I'm guessing, yeah, Andre Zio, our goalkeeper, shy, reserved, and very friendly, Alfonso Cross, reserved, quiet, gourmet, Tim May, Casino is the best way to multiply my money. I'm a luck. Why does he have a stripper pole over here? Eli Beatmaker. Oh, look at him! Look at him! It's Eli! <laughs> awesome! <laughs> and we're back at the cucumber. Uh, we saw him, didn't we? Let's see. Akipa Anderson. Oh, the sideburns. Holy shit. Nice. <laughs> Geronimo. Oh, look at him. Sex is the only important part of so of a so-called relationship. All right, Scorpion. That's Aaron. Oh, look at the shirt. It's quite quite bad. <laughs> Dan the man. <laughs> oh, Dan. There's Graloth. Yeah, that's exactly how I imagine Graloth is looking. Alcohol provokes the desire. Darzer. Yep, just like Darzer. Balance. Balance looks like he's working in a restaurant or something. And there's Uni. Uni apparently is a guy now. And she's got a teddy bear. How nice. The nun. <laughs> Look at this guy. Uh, <laughs> Alright. That's the final guy. Let's go. Ah, there we go. Look at that. Those are my guys. Your path to fame and glory oh, begins here. Eli, Whilst triumph Alfonso, and accolades Tim. are there for the taking, remember these achievements come at a price. Blood, control, sweat, la, la, la. and tears are shed on the way to the greatest prize in club football, the European Cup. Only the best of the best are even allowed to enter this fierce competition between champions. As you can see, the road ahead is filled with obstacles, but take heed. Oh. You will have all the tools needed to mastermind the success of your team. All right. Your goal is to climb up through the rankings and gain a place in the prestigious European Cup tournament. I will do just that. If you that. have what it takes to win the cup, then, and only then, will you join the Lords of Football. Oh, we actually have some fans here. All right, uh, the very loud gentleman just told us that... <laughs> We need to win that cup to join the Lord of Fo Lords of Football, and we will do just that. Stamina. All right, I've played a little bit of this. So basically, what you have here, just to to find my uh, like bearings, what you have here is you have different areas that you can set up, and um, where you can play people in, and you have this time here during which you can do just that. And I need to... Those are my players. You can... Oh, man. Shut up. Uh, you can filter them by where they're playing. And I don't have enough attackers. I really need more. Yeah, I got enough goalkeepers. That's that's for sure. All. And uh, down here you have certain filters. Now, my guys have assembled here, as you can see. Oh, there's a latecomer. Who is that? Andre, you're late. Oh my god, Dunka, you're even later. Send your flat. Yes, I will start selecting players in a second. Don't worry. Jaw Jr., there you go. 
Now these guys will tell me what they actually want to learn and I can set up more um, more things we'll train them all down here once you've gotten to know your players there are some hard days of training ahead of your team use the daytime to improve your team's skills on the pitch by setting up physical technical and tactical training exercises try to create the correct balance between these abilities in order to overpower your opponents balance all right so basically what they're doing, you set up these training exercises and you put people in there so they uh, they can work on this stuff. Um, let me see. No, 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 wait. I don't, I just want Dan. Defense, where's Dan? No, I just want... Oh. You guys train that. Dan and Darza are going to train that. Ja Jr. is going to train with the goalkeepers. And then we have people who would like to do some training here. We set this up. Strength over here and natural fitness over there. There we go. Yes. Thank you, whatever you said. And, uh... In order to claim the title of Lord of Football, oh, you will need a plan of attack. For this reason, the tactical editor is available to support you in organizing your team into yes. a solid unit. Yes. The main oh. office is also on hand, allowing you to analyze opponent teams and to see your progression through the season. This guy as is an ever-present force isn't within it? the club, the president has a list of challenges. By completing them, you can gain building upgrades and unlock more training exercises. Ethan Button and the <laughs> Oh my God! Oh no, I don't want to have any therapy with these guys. I want to set up a training for creative creativity. There we go. And I want to grab these guys. Hello, all of you. All of you. There we go. And I want to put you in the locker room to train some creativity. So finally, I've set it all up. These guys are training for stamina. These guys are training for aerial ability. Uh, Jaw is training our, uh, our goalkeepers, and these guys are training for passing. Wait, he doesn't. Wait, I mean, you can help him because there's not enough people to be playing with. And then we go to the tactical editor. Here we go. So basically, as requested, Dan is going to be our libero. this I'm gonna now John needs a little more support there put these up front so we're playing a 541 uh, <laughs> apparently <laughs> we're playing a 541 setting I want them to attack well wherever you can basically. want to call this uh, first setup there we go and just standard pressing I would say so we don't run into trouble counterattack on obviously passing whatever pass is good mentality standard for now I might set that to offensive and actually move more people up. Team setting, tackling standard, special roles. All right, my captain. Sorry, Cap uh, Zorin, but you're not the captain. 
I need someone with good tactical knowledge. 77, 79, 68, 76, 79. 86. I think I found my captain. Hello, Mr. Anderson. There we go. Then the penalties. It's gonna be Yami. Yami, you're my penalty guy. Then left free kicks, right free kicks, central. I'm just gonna leave that for now. And that is that. So these guys are training now, as you can see. And um, I'm gonna hurry this, hurry this up a bit because they're just, you know, they're in their, doing their stuff, getting ready. Oh. When night falls, it's time for your footballers to unwind with a night out on the town. This is your opportunity to boost the effects of the daytime training. Keeping the mood of your footballers high will motivate them to perform even better in the upcoming match. Awesome. So what I turn on now is the filter for needs. Basically every footballer in this game, as far as I can tell by now, has a lot of statistics as you can see. Due to alcohol, this guy's drunk. What the hell? Luis! Jesus! Nueva Palmira. Alright. Um, he's got... He doesn't want alcohol, actually. He's good with everything else. And his history is just with us. So these guys walk off into the subway. Come on, just there you go. And then they show back, show up again over here. Oh, one guy's already in the pub. What the hell? How the how did he get in here? Dunkai. Yep, he needs a drink. This guy wants food, so he goes to the restaurant. Oh, Darzer is looking for sex. Uh, I don't think I can help you with that right now, Darzer. Not. We got six guys in the casino. Yeah, boost. All gambling. Look at them. The nun. Eli, Yami, Akipa. And Tim, they're all playing. All playing. Alright, um. Oh no, I wasn't. I already saw that. Turning that up. And in the disco, how are we doing? The temptations of life can get the better of your footballers. Bad behavior and addictions can start to develop within your team and seriously affect their performance. Imagine finding a star player drunk before an important match. This type of behavior could be a possible consequence if you don't keep an eye on the nighttime activities of your players. There are buildings available within the club's grounds which recover footballers from a number of different ailments, like mm -hmm. low energy, injuries, mm -hmm. bad behaviors, and addictions. All right, guys. This is the end of the day, and uh, we are going to end the episode here. Tomorrow, we got a game going on, so we'll be back with that in the next episode of Lords of Football. Bye-bye.